the amount of times when I was just waking up in the middle of the night, also due to jet lag, but worried about my future in literal fear. Infinite. I've had these times so many times. I had this like every other day where I would just wake up in fear. Not even doubt, but it was fear. Like, wh where is this gonna go? What do I do if this doesn't work out? Like, how can I pay for the next food? Like, I, I was scared. But you know what I did every time I was scared? I opened my laptop and I went to work. I would just work until I felt better. You know, that's something that I've always had. And, and the beautiful thing is sometimes people say like, oh Max, like, you're only making money because of your brand. You're only making money because you've had mentors and so on and so forth. And of course, it's true. That's the point. Get a mentor, goddammit. Don't try to deal with these things alone. I'm here because I've had great mentors. But I also was able to actually implement the things that these mentors told me. And there's other people who had the same mentors who were not nearly as successful as I was because I put in the work. So take everything away from me. Take away my brand, take away the money, take away all my assets, take it all away. At rock bottom is where I feel the by far most confident and comfortable. I've been at rock bottom for years. You think I give a damn about the watches I have? You think I really, deep down inside, give a damn if I'm working here in this home office or if I'm working at some stinky Airbnb sleeping on a couch? I don't give a damn. Take it all away from me. I'll be able to work myself back up because I have the work ethic. That's all I've ever had. I wasn't particularly talented. I'm not good with numbers. I don't have the entrepreneurial spirit. I've never even thought about having a business. I didn't understand nothing. I had no clue. So this is not some guy who was always entrepreneurially minded who just kind of did it. This is about a regular folk person who just stumbled into it and then started taking responsibility and then starting to put in the goddamn work and then continuing the work regardless of what's going on up there in his brain. The worry, the fear, the self-doubt, none of this matters. Go let it fuel you and get to work. You might complain right now because others are doing better than you. That so-and-so makes it look so easy. Maybe you think like, oh, Max makes it look so easy. Yes. For me, it goddamn is. Because I have nothing else. And this is all I'll ever have. Putting in the work. So please understand, if you're doubting yourself, that's normal. Everybody's doubting themselves. I'm doubting myself. I'm pretty sure that goddamn Michael Jordan doubted himself every single day when he was about to become the MVP for the fourth consecutive role or whatever. Everybody doubts themselves. Please don't let Hollywood or the mainstream narrative make you feel isolated. Please don't let them make you feel ashamed that you're not confident. I would go as far as to say the more self-doubt you have, the better, right? Because that stuff can actually make you work. And work is the only thing that will get you to the end goal. Have a clear goal, have a clear path that you can follow. Ideally have someone that has followed that path, has created that path. You just have to execute that and then go get to work.